building the daycare center right in the same building with the training center so the parents can just, it's great, they drop their kids off on the way to class. And what? What, you're smiling? Yeah, I'm smiling. It makes me happy to see you so excited about a project. Will you make me happy? Mom? <laughs> Jesse. Yeah. Who's this? Uh, darling, I'm sorry. This is Charlie Banks, my husband. I told you about him. Uh, you're the one that shot me. Ah, uh, Jessica, that's that's right. I am the guy who pulled the trigger. Honey, it was an accident. You yeah. Know. What, what your mother means to say is I wasn't aiming at you. I was aiming at someone else. The Okay, but the truth of the matter is that I had no business carrying a gun in the first place, and the fact that I hit you is... I mean, Jessica, you and Bree and Natalie, I've come to love you like you were my own, and I could no more hurt you. But I did hurt you. I put you in the hospital. I scared your mother half to death. Stop. And no, really, I just, I only hope that you can try to find a way to let me make it up to you well I don't remember any of it so there's nothing to forgive you have a clean slate and anyone that makes my mom smile like that is good in my books thank you sweetheart do you want some dinner we finished but there's plenty left and I'm sure that Brie wants to see you oh I already checked in on her and she's oh. asleep I just came by to pick up this what is it oh it's the dress grandpa got it for me to wear to prom? It's not exactly how I remembered it, but I guess I can get it altered. So you're going to go? I decided you're right. I shouldn't miss my senior prom. And let me guess, I bet you're taking that handsome Brody fella, huh? You have the right to read. guy sure has a lot of fans in Landview. I mean, no, I mean, you can hardly walk down the street without somebody stopping to say hello or to thank him for his service. You know, he was in the Navy. I know. Yeah, he was in the Navy SEALs, though. That's the best of the best. I mean, now he's a police officer. God, like that's pretty hard to find. <laughs> well, he is a, a wonderful fellow, but I think Jessie has decided she's going alone. Well, I don't want to go alone. I want to go with Christian, but he seems to have forgotten that he's supposed to ask me and he asked someone else, but that's okay. I'm going to go by myself. Well, and you will have a lovely time. Yes. Sure. <laughs> but you'd have a better time with Brody. There's nothing wrong with going alone. You know, I go alone to events. Yeah. Sure you do. But you have a lot more fun when you let me tag along. I mean, and also, who are you going to dance with there? I mean, it is a dance, right? I mean, that's a prom. That's a dance. There's a dance floor. There's a band. There's one of those mirrored balls. Um, Charlie's right. I'm going to be sitting at a table all by myself, just a wallflower. Well, not if you go with Brody. <laughs> yeah, I, I can't lead him on. It wouldn't be right. Yeah, yeah, I guess. But you know, he is a big boy. I mean, you can just let him take his chances. And by the way, don't you owe him a date or something? I mean, didn't you tell me that there was some kind of a bet she lost? Uh, I may have mentioned it, uh -huh. but she's under no obligation. Well, sure she is. I mean, boy, I mean, a bet's a bet. You're, you're not a welcher. No, of course I'm well, not a welcher. There you go. And so this is your chance. You can kill two birds with one stone. You can let him collect on his bet. And because you know he's not going to let that slide. And then you have a date to the prom. And with the added bonus that the guy is a pretty handsome fella. I mean, you walk in there with Brody on your arm, and he's all gussied up in his dress whites and everything. And believe me, everyone is going to notice in that room. And I do mean everyone. So that's just um, something to think about. Yeah. Yeah, um, uh, I, I gotta go. Um, nice to meet you, Mr. Banks. Charlie. Charlie, of okay. course. See you, Mom. Yes. Thanks. Man, you are a crafty old fox. What? I am so impressed, Mr. Banks. Uh, Charlie. There's still so much about you that I have to learn. In fact, you're quite the schemer. Well, I've got a few tricks up my sleeve. Oh, oh Lord, nothing you learned from Dorian, I hope. No, did I tell you that you tried to get me to come in under a bid on that one section? Okay, you're changing the subject. Oh. 
Look, Travis Craig, this is just unbelievable. You actually just manipulated Jessica into taking Brody to the prom so that he could have another chance with her. Oh. You don't miss a trick, do you? <laughs> I'm just trying to keep up with you. No, no. You wanted her to go with Brody just as much as I did. Yes, I absolutely did. And I I didn't mean to overstep, but I saw the opportunity. You saw it? Charlie. Hmm. I'm so glad you did. Oh, God, I'm so glad you're here. I love you so much. Natalie! Sorry. What's wrong? Todd's in the hospital. Oh, we 